Good evening, I am Gianni Dino, and for this evening, I'm going to perform a return demonstration on ophthalmic uh, medication administration. So usually, the drugs administered through this route uh, include uh, include effects that um, help dilate or contract the pupil of the patient, also relieve pain, discomfort, and irritation of the eyes, also um, have an antiseptic effect on the eyes, and also uh, treat infection of the eyes. So we're going to proceed with the demonstration right away. Okay, so we're going to review the doctor's order first. So we'll check how many drops um, will will each eye will how many drops will we will we will the health worker administer? Sorry, and then also what eye will be treated. So for this situation, we're going to treat both eyes so we're going to identify the patient so um may hapon may gabi ma'am kisagay tatangalan um claire sige so ma'am claire um ako di ang nurse nag assign ni moron pag uh help of guan sa imong tambal pag tumar sa imong tambal sa mata si gian di no so nakay idea on sa imong tambal yun ma'am so we're assessing the patient's knowledge on um, we're assessing the patient's knowledge on her medication. So current mom ang naa ni Moron is hypermelose, so eye lubricants here yeah, and also um, reduces strain. So kanisha mom um when she mukha gi order na tambal si mga physician, when you makapatama si mga situation run and hoping na ma alleviate gamay or ma ma ease of gamay ang sakit sa mata, okay? So, parang ma'am, um, nangutan na ko kung isa yung pamati. Medyo sakit ang mata. Well, wala ra kagaluya or anything. Wala. Mata ra dyan. Uh -huh. Okay, so we're assessing the patient's consciousness and also the um, patient's ability to follow instructions. So, parang ma'am, makapiyong ka sa yung mata. Okay, then makabuka ka. Sige, sige. So, karun, um, karun, ma'am, um, ako na i-assess si Mohang Mata. So, we we will assess um, the patient's external eye structures to see if um, the patient will be, uh, the, the medication that we will administer will be contraindicated or not. So, ako na i-assess, ma'am, ha? Okay. Because. Okay. Sige, so upon assessing, um, there are no um crusts or any scratches of the external eye structure. So, what they're going to do is, um, we'll check if the patient is allergic or. Uh, allergic to latex. So, ma'am, mo ask na ko if allergic ka of um, latex. Okay, so, uh, mga tambal, ma'am, anything? Wala. Wala upon. Excuse me. Okay, so thank you, ma'am. So, upon assessing everything, or uh, I'm sorry, uh, we're, we are about to assess the willingness, the willingness of the patient to, uh, to the patient, uh, if the patient wants to self-administer. So, Ganahang kag ikay mo kuan ma'am? Mo self-administer or ganahang kag ikay mo tumar sa tambal lang? Makaya na niyo mo? Dali, sige so. Sige so, malang to siya ma'am. So, now, um, everything is um, clear. We can now um, prepare the materials. We have here the kidney basin containing wat the water. So, the facial washcloth. The medication. Uh, this is um, hypermelose or IMO, and also facial tissue, gloves, alcohol. So we're going to wash our hands and uh, apply gloves.
So, ako lang i- ano lang. Before, ko mo... Ah, so gloves na ha? So, karun lang ako sa trapuhan ang imuhang mata. So, inner cantus to outer cantus. So, kanis na yun na ha? So we are now ready to administer the medication to the patient on the patient's eyes. So we have here the IMO. So this is our second time shooting. So uh, this is a reshoot basically. So I'm not going to drop the medication on her eye directly again. But I'm just going to demonstrate how or how how the um, how the process works. So after clearing out the crusts of the patient's eyes, um, we're going to our non-dominant hand is pressing against the bony orbit and retracting the lower eyelids, exposing the um, cantus or I'm sorry the conjunctival sac. And then our dominant hand will rest on the patient's um, patient's forehead, and within one half inch. So, okay, okay. So, so if there is any systemic effect on the directly on the eyes, we're going to press on the naso lacrimal duct gently for about thirty to sixty seconds. So assuming that 30 to 60 seconds has passed, we're going to proceed with the next eye. Same lang ma'am. Exposal na ako ha. Okay. Feel. So one drop na ma'am po to both ma'am. So after administering, um, so now um, the patient has already been administered with her ophthalmic um, or her hypermalose or the IMO. What we're going to do is um, Assess the patient um, patient's condition again. So, um, current mom, nilabay, assuming that uh, 50, 15 minutes have passed, so nilabay naman ng 15 minutos, mom. So, kumusta yung pamati? Mas makakita ako. Mas makakita na ka? Oh. Okay. Um, dili na sakit? Dili. Good. Magluha, sige. Dili. Okay. Sige, mom. So, if anything, nakikailangan or anything, na nag-call like dito ha. Okay, so, ma'am, tisha ma'am, thank you, Kaya. So, dispose all, dispose everything. Um, so, after disposing, we're going, uh, we're going to record after disposing and after administering, we're going to record uh, everything that we have done and also take note of any side effect or adverse effect on the patient. So that is all for the ophthalmic uh, medication administration and thank you for watching.